Now, last year, last year, my CLK, uh, Mercedes. Stupid, <laughs> stupid car. <laughs> this stupid wheel arch. You may think it's stupid, but it's very determined, OK? My CLK, it said, one day when I got in it, 24 days until the next service. Now, I mentioned this on the programme a year ago, OK? And I thought, I wonder what'll happen if I take it to 25 days? Because its German brain won't be able to compute the fact that somebody has disobeyed a direct order. <laughs> OK? The thing was, on the 24th day or whenever it was, Mercedes turned up while I was out and took it away for a service, which really annoyed me. Good news. Yesterday, it suddenly said, nine days until service due. <laughs> Brilliant. What I've done this time is I've parked it in a London underground garage, and I'm not going to tell anybody which one. Because <laughs> I want to see what happens when it goes to minus one. No, that's dangerous. It could panic. But like a horse in the stems go mad! Or it's probably already been building a glider so it can escape. <laughs> I thought that's why I've put it in an underground car park and not a multi-storey so it can't fly away. Yeah. It's probably been specially trained to take a cyanide pill. <laughs> It'll have hidden it in one of its massive wheel arches. Right, then I must end it now. <laughs> So when I get back to it, you think it'll be dead? Ah, completely. <laughs> Just... um, last week we had the local.